Every so often, somebody asks me if Skookum would ever consider opening a second Skookum house. And the answer is yes, emphatically. Uh, the fourth step in our four-step plan to accomplish our mission is to export the Skookum approach to child welfare to other cities. So yes, we'd like to do that, but uh, not in Whatcom or Skagit counties uh, and not anywhere in Island, Snohomish, Pierce, or King counties because we have partners, sister agencies, who operate similar programs in those places, so we're not needed there. We would be looking for a community uh, that is like Bellingham was in 2014 when we got started. Specifically, a place that has more children in foster care and then foster homes and no good solution to the 72-hour problem. It would also be nice if there were a college nearby, uh, preferably one with a human services and or social work program. Uh, we believe that our proximity to Western Washington University has been key to our success, so uh, it'd be nice to have uh, that benefit for a, a planted program too. In addition to the community need, we want uh, to have three things. Leadership, some money, uh, and a facility. We'd like to have two people in place to fill three roles. Uh, the first role is a fundraiser. That's the role I played uh, in the early days and still play today. The job is to find support uh, in the form of giving and volunteering in the community uh, where we're hoping to plant. The second role is the role of program manager. That's the role that Abby uh, has played, and it is a, about running the day-to-day -day operations of the house program. Uh, you know, coordination, licensing, child care, practice, intake, um, um, volunteer training, that kind of stuff. Finally, one of those two people, and it could be either, needs to be the boss. Second, uh, it would take some money to launch a second Skookum House. That program spends about $11,000 a month when it's fully operational. So fully loaded cost of running Skookum House is $11,000 a month. In a community like Bellingham, which has a cost of living index of 108, uh, and I think we should have a war chest of somewhere between six to 12 months of operating expenses set aside to fund um, the launch of a new location. So, you know, adjusted for cost of living, uh, in the location where we decide to open. And finally, we need a building. When we started in Bellingham, uh, Hillcrest Church offered us the use of a house that they owned, and it has worked just perfect. We'd want something comparable in our target location. Uh, roughly 2,000 square feet, at least three bedrooms, no more than 30 minutes from a major interstate. So that's what we're looking for. A community with needs similar to what Bellingham had in 2014, some leadership, some money, and a house. If you have those things, let's talk. Maybe we could start a second Skookum house together.